What's going on guys, Balkan Architect here and in today's video I'm going to be announcing this week's advanced Revit course that's going to be covering everything you need to know about stairs in Revit. So the point of this course is to take a simple tool like the stairs in Revit tool and to show you how you can manipulate that tool in a creative way to create these cool looking staircases in Revit. So we're just going to be using the basic tools. When you go here, select the staircase, go here in edit type, you've got some of the basic tools for adjusting your staircases and just making some basic adjustments. But you can actually do a lot with all of these basic adjustments and you can create some really creative and cool designs. In this case, as you can see, I've got this uh, staircase that's got only one support in the middle and then we have these glass steps. Also, we're going to be covering the topic of multi-story stairs, so stairs that are spanning across multiple levels. And uh, when you create this type of a stair, even if you make some changes to the levels, the stairs will adapt and some staircases will get more stairs, some will lose some steps. Also, we're going to be creating this cool looking rusty sheet metal stair with just a few clicks. Also, we're going to be creating this monolithic stair, just a regular monolithic stair, but it doesn't have that ugly concrete facing. So it's got uh, basically this covering in uh, marble and everything is done within the stair tool. So we've created this kind of a stair finish for our monolithic concrete stair. Okay, this one we've already covered. We're going to be creating a classical stair with this nice profile and this nice wood. And for that, we're also going to be creating some railing with a, a nice profile just to create one of those classical stairs. And also we're going to be covering uh, this concrete uh, staircase as well as uh, this uh, kind of a floating staircase that's adjacent to a wall. So all of these uh, staircases and a lot more. And the idea isn't just to show you how to create these staircases. Uh, for each one, I go really in depth uh, and showing you how you can edit, uh, use this uh, stair tool to make adjustments to the stairs, just going deep into the software, making adjustments, adding materials, uh, changing some values. And basically, after you finish this course, hopefully you will have a complete understanding of how the stairs tool works within Revit. Okay, so that's pretty much it. If you want to check that out, uh, check out my Patreon, first link in the description, and you can get access to this uh, complete uh, one hour, well, a bit more than one hour uh, long course, as well as all of my other courses. I've done courses on uh, some window families, basically an advanced, complete advanced course on window families, a complete advanced course on lighting in Revit and light families in Revit that actually work and cast light in all of the renderings and all of the, the comp complexity behind that is also explained. And also I have uh, a course, uh, one course so far on graphics advanced graphics in Revit and how to set everything up in your uh, models. And if you subscribe to that uh, uh, tier on uh, my Patreon, you will get access to all of the future uh, courses that I'm going to be doing and I do one course each week. Okay, so that's pretty much it for this video. Thank you for listening. Check that out. First link in the description to my Patreon. Get access to all of these advanced courses. And I'll see you with another tutorial in a couple of days. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.